right here. You come, you come to me. <laughs> <laughs> my daughter's that, winning. Wow. And you don't or? even suck my dick. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe you can <laughs> go. Maybe you suck my dick. You don't even have the courtesy to suck me on my penis. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah. I was wondering, maybe we could. Uh, Put your penis in my hand. <laughs> See ya. <Yeah. laughs> See ya. Don Goldblumo. Don, Don, Don Goldblum. <laughs> they come into my shop every day and they fuck me in my ass. <laughs> every morning it's fucking, fucking, fucking and they leave me and I'm filled with cum. <laughs> Have you tried calling the police? <laughs> The police don't care about sexual assault. <laughs> they only care about keep making sure Wall Street is something. <laughs> they are here to protect the private property, to, not Italian as a whole. To so. be honest with you, no, I didn't even bother calling. <laughs> because I saw a thing on Instagram that said don't. I, my whole sexual history will go on, on trial. <laughs> I used to be a slut at Don <laughs> Donegal de Bloom. I shouldn't me. have been <laughs> Wearing, <laughs> I was wearing a little, a little tight suit. You could see on my balls. Well, yes, I was on the second arrange. <laughs> oh no, Don Goldblum <laughs> thinks they well, have a point. Very antiquated. You come here asking for a favor, and you're wearing a gimp costume. <laughs> <laughs> You've got on a thong. <laughs> <laughs> You're wearing a- assholeless pants. <laughs> the, you know, the top says, please rape me. <laughs> <laughs> These are the only clothes I could afford. <laughs> I've come over for a reason. Because of my family, we come, in, we come here and we don't have any money. It's <laughs> what I wear on the boat of Italy. That's that would be genius. I'll tell you what I do. I'll lease you new clothes <laughs> for seven hundred and eighty percent interest back. Don't don't Goldblum, thank you. <laughs> but if you don't have the money, guess who's being turned out? We're going to take you to a whorehouse, and then you'll be raped all day long, <laughs> every day. And I'll sell you to the boo, the boo, because it, it's, yeah, yeah. it's not a good mafia movie unless they say the They say it one Yeah, you times. have yeah. to put it in the script. Mm-hmm. Oh, right. Uh-huh. We were talking about also Norman Jeff Goldblum. Mailer. Norman Mailer, Jeff Goldblum. No, her, uh, Jeff her, Goldblum her, her just stays her, in there. Her yeah. pussy is uh, trash. Uh, uh, her pussy may be uh, <laughs> trash, but I, I would, I would, I would, I would, uh, would, uh, 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 f- fuck it. If I'd want to. F- I'd want to fuck it. I'd so. maybe try f- <laughs> uh, f- uh, uh, to put my penis in it. <laughs> I wonder if he did get pussy Kelly from Ripa. anyone. Gold, Goldblum and Kelly Lee. That mm-hmm. was a show for a while. <laughs> yeah. Uh, 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 good morning. Uh, uh, the morning is the, the one of the, the uh, best times to get pussy. Uh, <laughs> You wake up, have a croissant, maybe. <laughs> Jeff Goldblum on fucking NBC at 8 a.m. talking like that. Next to a, a drunk woman. Yeah, just Huda. One of her eyelids is shut. Yeah. Uh, good, good, good uh, morning, America. Good evening, China. <laughs> In the middle of the night over there, probably Chinese people having sex. Uh, in, the, in the dark of the night, making more Chinese people. More, more, more uh, sideways vaginas. Oh, that was another thing you oh, had. Yes, Harry the Harry Potter. Potter. Oh, I forgot all about the, the Harry Potter the Harry angle. Potter trick. Yeah. The classic J.K. Rowling trap. What were we even talking about? Why were we even talking about Harry Potter? I don't know. But the- bum, bum, yeah. bum, bum, bum. <laughs> Yeah. Trying, to, trying to remember how that song goes. <laughs> yeah, that, that took up a nice ten minutes. Uh, well, welcome to Pussy Getting uh, Class. Uh, today's right. lesson is 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 how to get a uh, cast a spell on a oh, Chinese right. girl's Harry, pussy. Harry Potter had slaves or something. Uh, perhaps you would want to do a a a one on one tutoring. Uh, maybe I can. Uh, maybe we'll we'll do lesson plans <laughs> in your dorm. Uh. <laughs> yep. Jeff, 
She's seven years old. <laughs> Jesus, Jeff. She's a child. <laughs> She's only seven in Chinese years. That's about two. <laughs> if you do the math, they love it. <laughs> These people love uh, math. I don't think it's a problem, yeah. Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> you got my blessing. <laughs> <laughs> you know, um, actually, what house you would be in, you both would be in if you were in Harry Potter? Me? Gay Sex Fendor. Mm. Oh, that wasn't one of the houses. That's the two you guys, that's no. the one you guys would be in. I would be in Gryffindor. I'd be in the Big Brave Dick one. Thorin. Mm-hmm. Well, you guys were in Gay Sex No, Savio, you're a Hufflepuff. No, do not, do not you're say I'm a Hufflepuff. You're an absolute Hufflepuff. Uh, one of the houses is for for very fat people. <laughs> <laughs> it does uh, sound like it's for fat people. Yeah, Some of our, fat our fatter students uh, will, be, <laughs> will be in the house for uh, for larger boys. Uh, Bob Bob's big boy, if you will. <laughs> Sort of a sort of a breakfast situation, <laughs> sort of a Harriet Tubman sort of vibe. <laughs> Harriet Tubman uh, sounds like a fat girl's. Voice. Does yeah. actually? Yeah. Yeah. You think, what, do you think the Underground Railroad would have happened if if Harriet Tubman had been fat? Oh, been... also Harriet Tubman. Something, something about Jesse NASCAR. James. Yeah, Harriet Tubman was married to Jesse James. Oh, right. Yeah. right. It's fucked up. Well, you just want to see the hot sex. I just want to see those more big, and Whoopi Goldberg. fat no. Goldberg titties out. Just Jeff Goldblum, like fucking at the Ouija board. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, Patrick, if you can hear me, <laughs> maybe you could have uh, what will be uh, uh, suck my penis. <laughs> as you. And when I get to heaven, I'll give you uh, uh, fifteen dollars. <laughs> <laughs> you see him in the living room at night. Glenn Close coming downstairs. Like, what you up to, Jeff? <laughs> uh, disgusting. Get out. Never mind. I lost my boner. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was uh, I was just trying to get Patrick <laughs> to have Whoopi suck my penis, <laughs> that he could maybe possess Whoopi. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to get sucked. He's one he wants to get uh, sucked. Glenn. Just get all the <laughs> Give me fifteen dollars. <laughs> Well, I'll suck your dick. Nobody wants you to suck your dick. <laughs> Get out of here, you fucking bitch. Uh, Glenn, you're ruining my seance. <laughs> Goddamn. Gold- Shouts out to Goldblum, man. <laughs> Trying to get ahead from Patrick Swayze via Whoopi Goldberg. Yeah, yeah I've been using the Ouija board to ask him. <laughs> He's in the living room at the Big Chill house by himself at night. <laughs> uh, Patrick, Patrick, yeah. it's Jeffy. <laughs> it's your friend, your friend Jeff. <laughs> Have you seen that interview with him? He's on like a red carpet somewhere doing like promo for Disney Plus, Mm-mm. and he's just fully on cocaine. He's like the gold bloom. His you could tell like he is geeked at. That rocks. And he's like, he's doing the fucking, like, the teeth mash. And he's just like, Mm -hmm. Disney Plus is uh, amazing. (laughs) Yeah, like, like, he gives a fuck about Disney Plus. It's (laughs) one of the most uh, incredible streaming Mm -hmm. services. They keep saying, uh, uh, Disney Plus. And what is the plus? Does it suck your dick? (laughs) 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 What is this? What is What's the plus? The plus? <laughs> What's the plus then for yeah. do, do you? Uh, do, do, do you? Uh, does it your, also suck? Your, uh, penis, your penis sucks. Does it also suck on your dick? <laughs> <laughs> uh, does it dance? Does it sing? Does it, maybe it sucks on your dick. <laughs> you guys see that picture where he had like two young ass hot girls? Yeah. In a headlock? Yeah, people tried to like cancel him for it. I mean, he's I about know, to just I have know. a good time. Yeah. I'm Martin. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and my bookie. <laughs> it's, uh, you can have sex with the website. <laughs> uh, MyBookie.ag is one of the only websites that you can have sex with the website. 
Wow, that's cool. <laughs> Man, having sex with things you can't have yeah. sex with is awesome. I've uh, always wanted to fuck a website. <laughs> I'll play bed when, when what? An opportunity to fuck your computer. <laughs> Or maybe, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, uh, it's one of the few websites you can load up and just put the computer right uh, right into your ass <laughs> <laughs> and type uh, on the computer with your ass muscles. Using your ass muscles. <laughs> <laughs> wow! It's just, it just says original Goldblum iMac ads. Yeah, I remember. Those. Yeah, yeah. I do. Uh, uh, think, dance, play. Uh, you can put the computer in your ass. <laughs> <laughs> The new iMac, you can have sex with it. You can put your penis on the oh, iMac. <laughs> oh, for those like orange and blue. And yeah, green yeah, ones. the original yes. one. Well, that was like, that was where like Apple was like, let's be cool. And they came out with the iMac. And those, that was that big campaign um, with Goldblum. I did think they were cool. I was a child. Yeah. But I, I, he I do remember thinking those were cool computers. Yeah. And being I'm so excited about this. You know cool. how easy it is to take your home videos and turn them into movies? Listen to this. You get an iMac, of course. Get your digital video camera. Hook it up and start iMovie. They've got effects in there now. You can, um, you know, make it real fast. Ooh. Or get slow motion, make it dramatic. Or you can take a piece of music, put it under your footage, and all of a sudden, people are laughing, yeah. crying. I don't know, whatever you want. I've got cheesy ideas. But you'll do something creative that will make you want to go, ooh, let's watch that again ooh. and again and again and again. Oh, the oh, new iMac! You can load it up. Yeah. You can pull up. Pull up. This is really cool. They got they got gay pornography on here, now. <laughs> <laughs> and you can look at it. You can pull out your cock. I don't know. I've got cheesy ideas, but you, <laughs> you can pull out your cock, beat off in front of all of your friends. <laughs> The entire computer will fit in your ass. Put it the whole thing in your ass. Just oh, take off your pants, sit down on the top of the computer, and keep pushing until it's inside your body. <laughs> oh, I almost shit. I like my penis getting sucked <laughs> by a computer. <laughs> the, new, the new iMac, you can shove it directly in your ass. <laughs> This is cool. Check this out. You can laugh, dance, sing, fuck the computer. Fuck the computer. <laughs> <laughs> You're watching Family Feud. I'm your new host, Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> and what do we have here? The faggot family. <laughs> um, our name is uh, Stevenson. <laughs> yeah, it's not. Please stop calling. Don't be calling this that name. <clears throat> Goddamn. What are some classic Goldblum flicks? Uh, Jurassic Park. You got... How'd he get famous? What were his... Jaws. <laughs> no, he wasn't yeah. in Jaws. I think we're going to need a bigger anus. <laughs> I think we're going <laughs> to... We're going to go out to the ocean. Uh, uh, we're going to try... <laughs> we're going to put the shark... Uh, we're going to try shoving the shark uh, into my ass. <laughs> 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 oh, <boy. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It was bad. Uh, it's probably uh, earlier. I got a little carried away taking out the garbage, <laughs> and I shoved it all up my ass. <laughs> it's kind of what it smells like. <laughs> Jeff, are you okay? Uh, sorry, I, I walked past the litter box and I couldn't help but shove all the cat Poor shit up my ass. Be shit in my ass, <laughs> <laughs> and then pretend I'm a kitty cat. <laughs> Uh, pisses off the cats. The and cat shows dominance. Him. A lot of people don't know how to show dominance to a cat. You got to take its shit and shove it in your ass. <laughs> show the cat who's boss. <laughs> uh, I can't wait to bring my my black daughter <laughs> to meet dinosaurs <laughs> and perhaps get a piece of pussy. <laughs> From one of the dinosaurs, <laughs> yes. Did you uh, perhaps uh, give yeah. one of the dinosaurs a human pussy? It's interesting. Uh, I don't know why I'm on this trip. <laughs> uh, my, I'm a professor of dinosaur sexuality. <laughs> <laughs> and they brought me along to see if I could create some lingerie for the dinosaurs. 
<laughs> yeah. They made them all women so they couldn't get get cock. Yeah. It's fucked up. Why wouldn't they just kill the raptors? Why wouldn't you just make it a park full of peaceful The little, like, cup, the cup on the dashboard that they're, like, looking at the water. And they're just, like, watching it to see where the dinosaur is. And then Jeff Goldblum's, like, slipping a roofie into the... <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, don't mind me. No, sorry. Uh, mm-hmm. Maybe we could rape one of the dinosaurs. <laughs> uh, oh, there's one. <laughs> Look, we're trapped on this island. We're going to have to rape yeah, our way out. Yeah. Perhaps we could rape one of the dinosaurs. <laughs> I've got plenty of tranquilizers. <laughs> like, well, that would take thousands of those pills he's like oh I has anyone have it all. has anyone seen my black daughter <laughs> wait he doesn't have a black daughter in that movie, doesn't does he? he i thought he did in the sequel maybe maybe in the sequel he's got a black daughter that does uh-huh. gymnastics what I the fuck does jeff this. goldblum do in that movie he's like he's a scientist no? he's the guy who's like it's uh, chaos <laughs> <laughs> is he on the trip or does yeah, he he's work on the for trip. them he's, on, he's one of the guys that they hire to like judge whether it's a good idea they hire jeff oh he's like a marketing consultant no 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 he's a scientist but he's the one who's he's a he's a mathematician yeah he's talking about chaos he's like they needed somebody to add up all the dinosaurs (laughs) let's see here one you have sam one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven (laughs) dinosaurs oh fuck but yeah uh, we give the dinosaurs a hand job. <laughs> <laughs> All the dinosaurs were girls, which is pretty fucked up. Mm-hmm. Why wouldn't they just neuter them? Because mm-hmm. in some species, men and the f- male and female look much different. Some yeah. birds, the women are big as shit, and the guys are little guys that just mm-hmm. get pussy. The guys have like uh, sexy plumage to attract mm-hmm. the women, and they have to learn dances. Because mm-hmm. that way, they tell them their nut is good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. He, this is like a scene in, in Jurassic Park where like Jeff Goldblum has to shoot one of the Velociraptors. They're like, "Have you ever even fired a gun before? Have you ever killed anything?" He's like, "No, but I uh, had to have sex with Glenn Close and the big, <laughs> during the big." Believe me, sleep. I've done something. Much, he's like looking, much more disgusting. He's looking at the camera. They're like, "Yeah, Jeff, uh, very fun, very read the line, very funny." But we're gonna go. Let's try it a couple times with just the actual lines in the script. <laughs> Glenn Close doesn't exist in the Jurassic Park universe. It's a good line, but you're Dr. Ian Malcolm, <laughs> not Jeff Goldblum. I heard of this actor who had sex. And, <laughs> and Glenn's, Glenn Glenn's lawyer has preemptively contacted us as soon as we cast the movie. <laughs> <laughs> demanding that you are not allowed to mention her. In fact, they do it on every production you're involved in. Mm-hmm. After, uh, what was that? The Bug? What movie was he in? The, the Fly. fly. Yeah. After after you mentioned it in The Fly. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. After he turns into a fly, it's like, I'm still not as gross as Glenn Close's pussy. Mm-hmm. That may have been before The Big Chill. But... No, not, not in the one we made. Yeah. yeah. Adam? I'm sorry. Oh. Uh. Maybe try cushydreams.com. Uh-huh. <laughs> Maybe try. Maybe try so smoking high quality CBD. And if you like having sex, you love, love cushy dreams. You love cushy dreams. <laughs> you love having sex with cushy dreams. Cushy does sound like pushy. pussy dreams. Mm-hmm. Are you waiting? I'm hoping for that? I get a yeah, lot I'm more waiting. Harry Connick Jr. <laughs> now that Jeff Goldblum is a sex pest. Oh yeah, he's right. He, what Goldblum. Did they I don't think it's been established. I think it's rumors. Is this thing that he just slinks around being creepy? Because like yeah. that's his whole. Everyone deal. knew that. Yeah. There was an interview he just with walks him. Walks around with this huge dick out. Does, does he, he have a big dick? dick? Oh my god. He definitely wow. does. A huge dick. Yeah. That's a big dick kind of guy. Yeah. That is a big he dick kind of guy. I mean, like the the term "big dick energy" is overused, but like yeah. you can t- tell by the. I'm not face. shocked at all. Yeah, I definitely could see Goldblum just walking around with a monster. If I remember his legs. correctly, I think it might actually be like overly big, like wow. cumbersome. Is there any movies where you can kind of see a cock print that we can yeah, check out? No, but you Park. can just find naked pictures <laughs> of the, ap- the, the Apple commercial. <laughs> <laughs> the old Apple commercial. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's it's uh, uh it's about creativity. It's about dancing. It's uh, I I feel uh, I 
I hated those commercials. I don't even yeah, remember really. that. That was like for the old Macintosh computer, right? Yeah, Macintosh. Are you gay? Try it out. <laughs> Try it's it San out. Francisco. It's, you, uh, how do you know you don't like kissing a guy? Macintosh. <laughs> <laughs> You're in a bathhouse. You're trying to get clean. We're here in San Francisco. We're just. I. I. I can't wait to just try. Just give it a taste. <laughs> Just try it out once, maybe. So what? Who's who's saying Gold Bloom is a, a sex pest? Some lady, some journalist is like, I've gotten so many well, emails. Well, it's Nicole Cliff, right? Right. That's she crazy like, though ran to, the toast to do that. And then married like a billionaire. Yeah, she's now like she just does nothing all day but tweet. She Damn, tweets respect. and, and takes an awesome down life. takes down honorable men that. <laughs> Look like hotter versions of me. <laughs> he, is, he is totally a hotter version of me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Wait, but I mean, she hasn't published that anything. Age well, if you Hopefully. age in that direction. Um, what did you say, Stav? But she didn't publish anything. She just said she just tweeted like I've heard. I'm she hearing said a lot. she's collecting emails yeah. and they're shocking. You know, journalism collecting yeah. emails. You know, email collector. <laughs> Isn't that weird to just say before you ha- like before you've written? Yeah, anything? that's what we would call unethical <laughs> yeah, journalism. Yeah. By the way, that is that's what, what real would, journalists would be. You know, that's what I would reprimanded guess. for. As a man who you're wrote not supposed to give teasers before <laughs> yeah, a story. Yeah. <laughs> He's probably just one of those guys that's like fifty or sixty and fucks like nineteen year olds and it pisses off ladies. Probably. Like that's true. But I mean, he could if, also be raping. You never know. He could, but I wait. don't know. I, let's wait for the I, story. I'm also he not going to look into it because, as far as I'm concerned, it's just celebrity gossip. It'd be great if they get it. It's, right. it's bad, yeah, like it's as bad as the Kevin Spacey stuff. Like he fucking like like raped <laughs> a 14 year old girl, <laughs> and then Kevin Spacey is like, uh, or Jeff Goldblum is like, uh, I just uh, I'd like to come out publicly and say that I'm Jewish. To preempt the story, I've struggled with this identity. Silence! <laughs> I got that one. That was fun. <laughs>